Hello, this is Larry again, and uh, we'll start at our website, rapidsetbuildings.com. And way down on the bottom, uh, you click the uh, pricing web system. So we'll click that, and we're already, I'm already logged in um, under my account. And so we'll get a building quote. And as you can see, we're up here in uh, English measurements in simple features. So I think today we'll just call this one uh, a test and we'll come up with a zip code and then you can see down here that you've got a lot of choices uh, like a, a clear span or a single post or two posts and the same thing with the single slope uh, unsymmetrical hangers this would be a typical hanger with a bifold uh, typical hanger with a hydraulic a fly through meaning on both door on both sides on for these models but let's go ahead and just click a simple uh, one and we'll just do a regular 30 by 40. So down here we'll go uh, uh, let's go 30 by 40 actually we'll go uh, how about uh, 57.25 and then it will figure out for you the inches and feet or if you wanted to put inches and feet it would figure that out too. Uh, let's go by 16 and roof pitch uh, let's go 2. Uh, 2 feet for every 12 foot. Go next step. And this screen uh, brings up the default loads and codes for your zip code, but you definitely need to confirm it. And I'll show you if you need to edit it, even in simple mode. You have to agree and confirm, but if you wanted to edit values, like uh, you want exposure C, or in my case I want 30 pounds snow, or um, the rest of it looks good. So you just click Edit Values, and uh, a couple of the boxes open up here, and you need to make sure um, of what you need um, to get the correct building design. And then also, if you need calculations, they're right there. <coughs> okay, now uh, this page from the from the snow load and the wind load, we come up with basically a, a, a generic snap to frame line. Um, of what we think would be the optimum for those loads. And in this case, it picked uh, 9, 12, 9, meaning there'd be a column on your end walls right here. And this would be a main frame and a main frame. So let's say we want to put a door in right here. Uh, let's go with a, a 10 by 12 and center it. And we'll put in another one down here. How about a, let's go 8 by 8 and have it on the right side. And then next step, I pause the video here because it takes about a full minute to uh, grind through the design. But once this button becomes uh, continue, then you continue and you're all of a sudden in accessories and colors. So let's go ahead and add a walk door. And if you wanted a colored roof, um, you could pick a colored roof if you want. Or let's say you want insulation. Uh, let's go 3 inch and 3 inch and then go next step and this is the engineer design uh, that we just did and you can see here that you can do look at frames or anchor bolt plan or, or end wall and you click if you want the plans you just click here to download and go next step And then this is the quote. Uh, with here's the accessory. So this would be the building only with stamp plans to, and delivered to that zip code. Uh, this would be the accessories added, and then the total cost would be here, and the deposit for the building would be here. And you got a couple options. You could email it to yourself, or you could print the quote and order the building. Um, so that's it for the simple. Um, English measurements system and I'm Larry this is Rapid Set Buildings and thanks for listening